Hi, in this tutorial we are going to create a template for 3D facial scans. Create the template and give a file name. Right click on the template icon and give it an appropriate name. This name is very important and will be used by Viewbox to assign datasets to the template. The name must be unique among templates that reside in the Viewbox template folder. To help us in the construction of the template we are going to load a representative facial mesh. The first thing to do is to find the fixed points. Right click on the template icon and select digitized points. Use the digitizer to position the point on the mesh. Click the right mouse button. You can correct the position of the point by clicking again, or you can adjust the points later. We have defined all of the fixed points. Notice that when we close the box, the points are no longer visible. We need to create a graphic object that will show the points. Select the markers type, so that there will be a marker at each point, then set the type of marker and its size. We include all fixed points in this graphic. Then set the color of the markers to red. Our template will include semi landmarks distributed over the facial surface. We could create these one by one, as we did earlier, but a faster method is to create 400 copies of a previously created point. Any point will do. Here we are going to use Ilaria left. All 400 points are now at the same position as Ilaria left, but they are not visible because no graphic has been created for them. We create a graphic for the semi landmarks, using a different color to tell them apart from the fixed points. Now you can see them, as one point, overlapping our larvae. Our purpose is to distribute them over the facial surface. Select the mesh, and then right click on the brush tool, to set the brush size. Use the brush to paint over the mesh and select the area over which you wish to distribute the points.
drag the mouse on the mesh, holding the right button down. We deselect the eyes, because sliding does not work well in this area. With the mesh still selected, open the coordinates window. Scroll down and select the sliding points. Right click on the selection to bring up the menu. Select. Distribute on mesh. The points are now randomly distributed on the selected part of the mesh. Right click to bring up the menu again. Select, diffuse points uniformly. Viewbox will move the points until they are evenly distributed on the surface. There are two more things we need to do to complete our template. Specify which points will slide and which will not. This is defined in the sliding groups window. Create a new sliding group and set the points as fixed, or, as sliding on the surface. The last thing is to specify the sequence of digitization. That is, which points we are going to digitize and in which order. This is defined in the protocols window. The order can be changed by dragging the points up or down in the list. Make sure to save the template. Thank you for viewing. In another video we are going to use this template to digitize a facial scan and slide the semi-landmarks.